nous go pay tax for three, four years, oh, but if you go set up for Ikorodu, if you go set up for Ojo, so that all the big, big companies, they no go they centralize inside this same Lagos Island, Lagos Central. Make them start to go to Badagri Division, Ikorodu Division. We will give them incentive, make them go. And then people feel they live closer to where they work. Also, go they give companies incentives for all their workers where they work from home. So that nobody every day go they come work. We feed them like say, okay, Monday, people they work from home. Monday, Tuesday, people they work from home. The rest, they go come work. Or Thursday, Friday, they go work from home. The companies we go they do that one, we will go they monitor, we'll give them incentive, make them do that one. So these are the ways, because now about quality of life. If they stay four hours in traffic every day, people will not know, say, the man will stay four hours in traffic. Now, anger will go there, but he go get him, go vex for his wife. Family, they scatter. Marriage, they scatter. So many things. All of these things, they affect family. And family is the first most important unit of this our state. So we want everybody's quality of life to increase. Okay. Um, you they talk something. You say you be the architect of the new Lagos. Yes, what in that mean and why you adopt that appellation? Me, I be architect. So God just do it like this way. Lagos State need person way understand planning, urban planning, because that's now one of our biggest problems. They go, they chase people come out, just build new property. They go do development, cover our canals. You know, get proper urban planning model. We this now the thing we would do. You just see people just and feel one place like this, and then the place go flood. And we go to complain, say uh, global warming. No, we need architects. We fit do urban plan. We fit master plan the states. That's why I call myself architect of a new Lagos. A Lagos will go work for everybody. Nobody just put where they go. A Lagos will go work for people where they Badagri, where they Ojo, where they are Jeremy Feludu. Make sure their life. Now, minim, we set minimum standard for all Lagosians where they go to get good life. As a young person, where you be, and also you be one of the beneficiaries of not too young to run legislation, how you feel rate the level of um, support where you don't get from young people? And what's in your plans to include young people for your government if you win the governorship uh, seat of Lagos? I have got. A lot of support from all the plenty of young people with the legal state. Even Nigeria as a whole. Because you know when I contest for Senate, not at five where I did, where I be, my contest for Senate. And I get a lot of support. Um, my government is going to carry all the young people along. Because from the agri with the road, because you see all those young young boys, they won't walk home. Last week, I sit down with like three of them for Apple Junction for Amu. I talk to them. I ask them, see, if we bring work, you go do the work. You won't work. All of them say, we won't work. That because work no the way, they do this thing. And we know even happy, we'll be family man. One of them will go to school. But now we will work, they do. So we, must, we are going to create skill acquisition centers in each local government. That is 20 skill acquisition centers in the first two years when I enter office. And Whatever they want to learn, they go, okay, we'll work with them. We'll, we'll, say we'll just build the thing. We'll meet all these people. We'll say, oh, yeah, which skill you won't get? Which skill you won't use? This one makes sense for this, your local government. And we'll go train them. We'll go train them so that, and then we'll go down partner with all the companies with the Lagos Stock. Say, see, if you employ these people, we don't graduate from this program. We'll give this incentive. We'll reduce this, your tax by this, this amount. So now, systemic approach to the whole thing. And my government will, will carry all the young people along and make sure policy the way go make them productive members of our society. For 2017, you contest for chairman local, Ikeja, government. local government under Kowa Party. Yes. For 2019, now for under People's Democratic Party, mm -hmm. for the seat of Lagos West Central District. Yes. Now, you don't move to Labour Party to contest for governor yeah. of the state. Why this movement around? Why they move around? Because yeah. I remember say, when you take over party, you say not sake of say no godfather reason mm -hmm. for the party. So what can bring this movement? Well, in? All, all these movements where they talk, mm -hmm. nasty movements where they consistent. You know talk APC now. 
They say we won't move, we won't enjoy. We, we get mentality of if you beat them, join them. I've already go a piece since now. But now opposition where I don't did. My opposition to all the bad, bad things where they happen for Lagos, that consistent one, it never changed for one day. So even when I did PDP, I enter process, become governorship candidate for the party. But what will happen? I mean, I know a person will feel take injustice. That's not why I did politics. So you know if you do injustice for me, I go take down. That's why I move. Go start the process all over again. No be easy thing. So all the money we person don't spend for PDP, all the work, all the time, building structure, everything. But now principle, I believe in principle. That's not why I joined the Labour Party. Also, his Excellency Peter Obi is a role model. A person that I feel that if all politicians are like that in Nigeria, the country will move forward. A person that wants to serve. And I see myself in him. There are things that his values are values that I also ascribe to. These are also some of the reasons why I joined the Labour Party. As I don't do the Labour Party now, now the same fight where I fight. I want a Lagos so we go work for the people, not be for one or guy. And that's why I did here. For the national level, what do you think, say, the chance be for your party? You think, say, your party, if you win the presidential seat, or you think, say, now that person, you think, Peter will be if you win, I'll be eating, say, Nabola Tinubu go win. Labour Party hmm. is forming the next government in Nigeria, in Lagos State, and in several other states. Whether people like it, or not do you know why because power is from the people they say the voice of the people is the voice of god now you have seen people for the first time mobilizing without being mobilized they are organizing themselves they are using their own money to print materials they are campaigning they've left politics they, they, are, they have not left politics to the politicians anymore they are moving they are moving and i believe that the political class are going to be in for a big surprise because people are tired. No matter how you want to say somebody has money and is doing rally up and down the place, these are the people that have been in power for the last 20 years. Whether they were in PDP, whether the board came together and brought Buari, they now gone back to PDP, or the APC people that brought Buari, they want, they want to continue the legacy of suffering, that we are all suffering. The rich people are even suffering. Poor people are suffering. It has got to the point where bus driver too don't they complain of any reality that we say they chuck too much of their money. Everybody know how much we start this last year for fuel, for diesel, for kerosene, for Nepal. Everything don't go up. The money where they end still be the same. Everybody don't tire. So you don't need time to get leader. We get sense. All this one way, then they do, they go do a campaign, then go they insult themselves. That, how politics now one year, governance now four years, and that four years they affect everybody life, everybody, rich poor everybody. So me, we, I believe say Nigerians go elect person we won't work for them. We get we they young. Let me say go do it England, six months, they cheat himself, eh? All these people, they talk, say, they don't build new Lagos, but then they go abroad, go take injection. Which kind of Lagos do that to them build? Their papa, when they, they grow for this same Lagos, then they go public hospital, it good. Then they open their tap, what are they pop? Same thing for national. So, I believe, say, Nigerians don't wise. Their eye don't open. And I believe, say, they go do the right thing, they go vote wisely for His Excellency Peter Obi. People they talk something. They say Labour Party no get structure. Now so it be. The structure where all this we always talk about now structure to the share money. Now structure to put people for polling. Now structure to cheat, to do woo -woo, to intimidate. That's not the structure where they talk about. All the area boys then we go go scatter polling units. All the people we go share money by votes. We don't get that type of structure. But we get structure of people we go and work. We get structure of people we the volunteer. We get structure of people we go the polling units. We get structure of people we go the go, not do evangelism door to door. That one day. And the structure will they build them, will they build them, will they build them. See, we get challenges, but that challenge is not the opportunity because when we enter, we enter with clean slates. We will work for the people. 